Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we'll dive into the exciting world of asynchronous JavaScript and explore how to utilize the power of async, await. So, let's get started. Asynchronous programming is crucial when dealing with tasks that require time-consuming operations, such as making API calls or fetching data from servers. JavaScript provides several techniques to handle asynchronous operations, and one popular approach is using async, await. Now, let's dive into an example. Suppose we have a scenario where we need to fetch some data from a server. To make this happen, we'll be using a URL as a dependency within a useEffect hook, a common practice when working with React. By including the URL as a dependency, we ensure that our effect runs whenever the URL changes, triggering the data fetching process. Let's create an async function and call it directly. Now let's take a closer look at our console log output. When using promises, it's important to handle their state correctly. At first, you might notice that the promise is in a pending state. To resolve this issue, we need to ensure that we use promises. By using a wait in front of the fetch operation, we guarantee that our code will wait for the response before proceeding, preventing any issues with pending promises. To simplify our code and make it more efficient, let's create an async function and call it directly, eliminating the need for an extra function call. This immediately invoked function expression, IFE, optimizes our code by removing the unnecessary intermediate function call. 